If you are looking into buying cheap and safe FIFA coins, look no further than footcoinshop.net. They have the fastest service, an incredible loyalty reward system, and the best prices around. Use my creator code INCEPTION when you sign up for your account and get a 5% discount with your order. Hey guys, what's going on? Inception here, and welcome to another video. Uh, today, we have the uh, Barcola card to check out. I don't remember this guy's name because I don't watch PSG too much, to be honest with you, but he's like a a young talent that's actually really, really good. Like, it's... They're kind of on a cook session up top with uh, Barcola, Dembele, and Mbappe from highlights that I've watched, right? Not full games. But, um, yeah, the card looks interesting, you know? He's obviously been improved to a point where he's now uh, a five-star, five-star player. He's six for one, high, medium, five-star, five-star, controlled, right-footed. Um, play styles-wise, he has chip shot. He's got power shot, rapid... Press Proven, Trivella Plus, Quick Step, in-game attributes. Um, because of the height and stuff, I do think that the engine is going to make the most sense because with long shots and stuff, I couldn't care less about it. It's more so about finishing being in a good area, which it already is at a 96. And, you know, improving passing and dribbling capabilities because for general build-up play, it would be helpful to have because a card like this potentially in the side positions could be nice too. He has good position changes as well. He's got striker and right mid because... You know, depending on the team that you end up building, it could be very nice too, right? But um, yeah, it looks like a very interesting card. Engine improves the passing and the dribbling. Physical is probably like a, the only thing that's on the lower side, but he actually could be someone that dribbles really well. This has been a highly requested um, player to review. So that's why we're checking him out, right? So uh, hopefully the video does well, because some of the evils that I do are just not players that people would use for a long period of time, but... Yeah, we'll be using him in like a 4 one 2 and 2 He's going to be on stay central, get him behind for the most part. And uh, yeah, we'll see how he plays, man. Hopefully he's a beast. Oh, I got it. Nice. I got it. I got it. Good stuff. Oh, I messed up there. I messed up. If I did a first time pass, I don't know if the, the time would have been good, but maybe. Ah, uh, see, he has the he has the play style, but if there's a defender there, he's not he's gonna get it easily. Oh man. Ah, okay, so physical. I have to remember physical. I would have scored that. Physical, so he's going to be a little bit slower on the animation there. Oh, I thought, bro. Maybe a roulette would have been better there. So you just have to get used to it, but it's too late on that one. Great finish, though, eh? That was actually like kind of like a driven shot there. That was nice. Yeah, he's offside. Doesn't hold the angle from the first pass into the run afterwards. And still don't get it. Laura deflection. Nice flick. Oh, and I don't green it, man. And I don't green it, but he was cooking there, bro. He's on a cook sesh. Oh, he wasn't offside? I mean, I still shot the ball normally. You never know, right? But...
Ah, uh, that's not what I was like. Like I wanted that pass, but the pa the way that the pass came off could have been way better. He was making a good run afterwards. Huh. Imagine I got to that. Ah, nice try. Oh, you never know. I still don't score that. Wow. You see how he has that like emphasis spot in his shot, right? We gotta be very mindful of that for sure. Ah, got nothing there. When you have the trait, you can put more power behind your chip shot because it's more assisted, you know? Oh, I got the green on that, but no goal, no goal. Oh, okay. We move. There we go. Let's go, my boy. Sometimes it's better just to wait a little bit because they'll overcommit a shot that they think you'll take. So you just wait, see what they do, and then you go from there. Block. Ball pass. There we go. Get the runoff here. Ball roll Trivella. And there it is. I did it early and I still scored. Lol. Ah, oh, man. Gotta get that angle there, bro. There it is. Good run. Good run. We'll take that. Nice. I did do an elastico and then a first time left stick touch and it worked out there. It wasn't like super fast to get it off right away, but it still worked. Nicely done. I like it. I like it. Good stuff. I had to like really time the left stick stuff there. See, so situations like that, because of the body type and height, I'm trying to do like a quick left stick in that area. It doesn't come off. So you have to use like a like an R1 or an L1 after a skill move to like really pop it off, right? Like it has to be like this and then like an R1 or something, right? To kind of like get it off. There we go. Roll technical. A little elastical. Oh, it didn't register it. Nice.
Early, I still score. I'll take it. And I still scored. Still scored. This card's really enjoyable so far. The only the only thing that I noticed with him, obviously, is that because he's physical oriented, uh, you just have to be mindful of that when shooting. So I had to turn off the time finisher indicator because I'm not used to it. Honestly, I could take better shots if I take it off because I'm more used to that. But yeah, nice little finish there for sure. He's making really good attacking AI runs. Like he makes the angled runs, which I appreciate a lot. And there we go. Just have to walk your way there sometimes. And that's another rage quit. Nice. Oh, and I don't score that? Oh, he's going to leave right away, I think. Or no? Oh, he's staying. Okay, okay. Oh. Yeah, he saw the sweaty stuff. He's like, nope. Yet he has a sweaty team, though. Like, and player of the month, Mbappe, all that stuff. That's the FIFA community for you, right? Oh, maybe if I tapped it there instead. Trivella plus a cringy, cringy way to score unless you're Quaresma, but you know, he does have the player trait. Sometimes that skill move is like really jammy, like you get the bounce back and stuff, you know, just, it just depends. Like, see, he just did it right there and he actually got it. Ah, oh, the animation. Yeah, that's the that's the main thing with him, right? Like when he shoots, oh, he's gonna score his own net. When he shoots, the animation slow down. You have to get used to that for like timing your strikes. You know, the first time touch into a dribble, right? Because he does have that physical feel to him, right? It's a pretty cool team. <laughs> Bro, rare gold Van Dyke, man. That guy just... He holds up well, man. He holds up well. Ah, uh, see? Like, he has that, like, thing to him, you know? Like, it, it just slows him down sometimes in those, like, really uh, interesting areas, you know? It took a while to kind of like do the dribbling stuff there. Oh, I definitely should have got to that. Oh, if Charlton actually like pushed there, it would have been great. White time, white time, shall we finish? Good. Good, good, good. Nice. Go back in. Oh, we got the nutmeg. Oh. Oh, it's Varane. You know, Varane do be doing the thing. Yeah, that one, uh, because he's like under pressure in those situations, it's not going to do the loop in that area, right? Oh, that physical feel sometimes, man. Nice 
nicely done. Good skill move. Body to body there. The force to run here. I'll trigger maybe. There we go. I'll trigger again. Technical. Might be a yellow, red, maybe. Yellow card. Oh, thank you, EA, for doing that one year where if someone pushes out the goalkeeper, you score no problem. Thank you, thank you. Because there was a year where, I always tell you guys this, but there was a year where you literally could not score and when they push out their goalies like idiots. So whoever was that gameplay dev that did that, you're a G. Just gotta play it back with all that pressure. That was so weird. <laughs> that was awkward, man. Ah, man. Five star weak foot, no green. Doesn't score at an angle. Oh, the fact that you're offside is annoying there, for sure. Pressure tactics and he's offside. Whoa, this game's crazy, man. Whoa, this game's crazy. You can't miss that, bro. I, why do I have to green time that? Oh, wow. That is wow. Oh, you got a defensive player too. <clears throat> Couldn't get that off, eh? Oh, very close. Almost got the assist off. So you see a situation like that. So that's just regular dribbling, right? But his body type and the way that he does his animations, like just that little bit of pressure pushes him to lose the ball. You know what I'm saying? Okay, guys, so final verdict on the uh, Barcola card. So listen, uh, remember, guys, that there are different variations of this card. This one is going to be, I think, the most interesting for people because he's the best version of the card at a five star, five star capability, because there's some other cards you can get right now that are like four star, five star. It just depends on the direction that you ended up going. Right. So if I were to go to like easy SBC, for instance, and I were to show you uh, this card, right? you'll see that he has obviously a bunch of versions. We can see that he has four star, five star, four star, five star. And this version right here uh, with the five star, five star is the best version of that because the other one has like 89 shooting, right? So um, this is the one that we're reviewing. We could still obviously give you guys a very good example of what the cards are like because they're all gonna be very similar to each other, but obviously he has the five star, five star things. Okay, so the main thing here to mention with this card, right? in regards to in-game capabilities is two specific things, right? So one, because he is a six foot one player who has, let me show you guys right now, who has a high and average plus body type, he will have those moments of feeling physical. So you can see it behind the shooting animation and you can see it behind the running animation as well, right? So those two main things, his running animation is not gonna be 
as fast. It's not to say that it's not going to be fast. It's just not going to be as fast as some cards you could potentially use, right, with similar pay stats. And obviously, the other thing is going to be animations when it comes to you taking a strike, passing the ball, that sort of deal. Like sometimes it will take him longer because that animation, because of his body type, is kind of adding to the card, right? Those are the two main things to talk about. Now, generally speaking, the card is still going to be very good to use in game because having a player who is a five star, five star player is obviously a very big deal to work with. In my opinion, I would focus more on using a card like this in the side position because of his left stick situation with the way that it works with the body type. But you guys can clearly see that he still plays a striker position really well, right? Obviously, having that Trivella trait to get into those situations, to go for that ball roll tri Trivella, hitting it on the green time, is obviously going to be a really big deal to work with. But guys, you're not always going to get a situation to Trivella. It's always important to test out some of the other things, right? So as you guys saw during the gameplay, attacking AI works out really well definitely positions himself on the pitch really nicely for the most part um the shooting comes off as well as it can i would say because with his finishing in game uh when you do provide him with the engine chemistry style you're not messing with the finishing or the shot power could it be an ideal situation to potentially give him something that doesn't mess with the dribbling sure because that base mechanic is still going to be on the card so giving him something like a hawk to boost his pace shooting and physicality wouldn't be a bad situation either now generally speaking from the improvements of the card right you can see that this one is a skill moves training into an fc founder 2 into a weak foot training and then it's uh down here into a finisher which is what gives him that five star five star capability it's a really cool card to get for those specific links to the PSG and the French players. But meta-wise, the only things that are on the lower side is running animation, not being as fast as it maybe could because of the high and average plus. Usually when you're high and average plus, you got to be like a, a player that has like maxed out pace or you have other things that make you faster or you have a length that pushes the pace out of the card a little bit more. And then the other thing is obviously the actual animation to take the strike to pass the ball that sort of thing like you have to like work with that a little bit more so when you're taking those first time touches utilize a lot of the l1 r1 dribble i scored one opportunity being able to kind of like time that as much as possible right so uh be sure to do that as much as you possibly can because with this card in game right play styles wise he still has a rapid to work with and a press proven. Would it have been nice to give him a nice little cheeky technical? Yes, but maybe that's a thing that they give him in the future uh, to kind of compensate for that body type and dribbling animation that he has, right? So definitely still a very good card. Obviously, if you provide, if you need the links in your team, he's still going to be able to do work for you, but just be mindful of those two things, okay? So hopefully you guys enjoy this video today. I'll catch you guys for the next one. Thank you for sending me the card, bro. I really appreciate it. Peace out, dudes. Love you guys.